EC3, we got a video package for him that was very well done. His his thing is his he's in the top 1%. So just, you know, I got to give credit to Triple H on this here because they really just took the EC3 gimmick from TNA and they just, you know, dumped it right in NXT. They really didn't make any changes to it at all. They haven't called him Ethan Carter. Uh, you all know my solution to that. You just call him Ethan Cartwright the third, Or uh, what was the other name I came up? Oh, Cambridge. That was the other one. Ethan Cambridge. It's very easy if you ever have to explain what the initials mean. You just go with Carter. You go with, uh, with, with Cambridge. Or uh, Cartwright or something. Um, but I like how they tell you he comes from a rich family. They just don't tell you what family he comes from. I would pop big time if they ever do a segment where he visits his rich Aunt Dixie. And they actually use Dixie Carter in the segment, even if it's just like a one-time thing. Vince McMahon would never do it, but Triple H I think would. 